Hey guys, name is Finn. Are you ready to be scared in a fun and entertaining manner? Yeah, let's play let's play some DP2, no mentioning anything. It seems like I need to help a lady in white. And it seems like her 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 little animation was from System Shock 2, a game which I've never played, but which I guess I really should, but something scared me off, like maybe it was gonna be complicated or something. Is there a key? Oh! Is a key somewhere? There is a key. It's on a windowsill, I think. Or it's like behind some statues or something. Oh, there it is. Sort of a strange place. You'd think she would have given it to me, but I guess she had to test me with a little puzzle to test my resolve. My resolve is strong, so on we go. Well, it looks like that part's all caved in, vitrified. Y'all know my feelings on that. Yeah. This oh. way. That way, eh? More like this way, in case there's some loot or something like that. I mean, you never know, there might be. There doesn't seem to be very much loot in this mission, but there has been some, so thus I am, like, legally obligated to search it out. And this is really dark. And, uh... <laughs> I seem to have, uh... Oh, no, no, never mind. Not stuck at all. But still, this pl Whoa. I, like, went into that crate. It was haunted. Oh. Well, I get some light if I want to. I mean, who wouldn't want to turn on the lights as a thief? There's that hammer that smashed the glass. It's the exact same one. That's not the exact same one, though. <laughs> what are you talking about? Still, I don't know, man. If I were him, I would have put some loot here. But I guess I'm not him, so... I guess I'll turn the lights off. Yes, <laughs> serious. Ah, oh, well, some kind of windows. Well, here's the exit, I guess. Oh, what's this? And I don't have any lockpicks. I'm pressing the lockpick keys right now. And there's nothing. I have loot and a compass. I guess I have to. Whoa. Just a little bit farther. Why do I feel like a rat in a maze? If you say so, and that's half crates that are all cut off. I mean, that's pretty scary, right? That's some genuine Class A horror right there. No, I mean, I'm just ripping this mission. is really is awesome. I know I'm going the wrong way here, but I mean, I'm just sort of looking around. I mean, these lights are pretty cool looking. Oh, that was the wrong way, too. Well, I'm sure I can totally trust this lady here. I know what you want. You want to escape. To leave here and never look back. That's right. I give you this key to do so. But never fear. You will join us before the night is over. Really? Sorry. I'm not into socializing with spirits, evil or otherwise. Yeah, Garrett Spank Hop! I can hardly hear you. Is that like a heart-shaped key or something? Well, it's a key. There seems to have been some baddies who have perhaps spawned. Perhaps I should make a run for it. <gasps> Crap, I think I can wait for them to turn around if I want a ghost, but who wants to ghost this? Whoa! Chaka! I want to look at her eyes, they were scary! It's. Oh, 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 this is loading. Oh, okay, great. Great. Great! Oh, it was great! You know what? The lion's back in! Cookie to anyone who gets that reference. Whoa, yeah. Except, uh, well, it looks like she's going to shoot something at me. Anyway, her eyes are that, like, terrifying, like, instinctual fear, like, tiny dot. Seriously, it scares the crap out of me. I, like, you know, I always wondered if I can get in there, but I mean, I guess not. But now I am. Wow. What have we. Well, the white lady is just playing games with you. Use the key to get out. Okay, well... Well, I'm out of the warehouse, so, uh... You know. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Whoa! <laughs> hmm? Mr. Garrett? Is that you? Yeah. <laughs> Jeez, Barney. You scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Mr. Garrett, how, how did you get in here? My, you look half dead. Yep. You, you've been upstairs, haven't you? Uh -huh. You know that place is haunted. I've told you before. Yeah, I kind of noticed that just now. Nice ghost you have here. <laughs> now follow me. I've got some healing potions in here somewhere. Thanks. That'd be nice, Barney. <laughs> well... I seem to just have to follow him. I can't seem to get anywhere. I've got a bad feeling about saving there. I think I'm going to have to listen to his whole convo again. Uh. Okay, Mr. Garrett. 
You stay here. I'll go see if the boss has left yet. He wouldn't approve of me taking people in at this time of night. Of course not. <laughs> me? Of course not. <laughs> ah, well, it looks like I can't rip off his keychain. Oi, what are you doing? Oh, yes. Mr. Garrett, one more thing. Stay out of these rooms while I am gone. I mean it. Don't go tapping around where you don't belong. What? Me tapping around where I don't belong? <laughs> Perish the thought. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> well, now, <clears throat> I don't seem to have any keys or picks or anything, so I seem to have to do what he says. Oh, a uh ho. -oh. A minute. Oh, I can't go there. I see. Well, fair enough. Well, how about I just wait for him to come back like a good law-abiding citizen? <sighs> I tell you guys, how's it going? You having a pretty good day? It's pretty good. Around here, even though it's the middle of October, it's actually really sunny and pretty warm. This is on the west coast of Canada. It's pretty nice, and uh, you know, I didn't even have to wear a rain jacket and, and all that other kind of rain type rain stuff today. I didn't have to pour Rain X over my head? No? That guy sure taking a long time. I've got a crazy idea. How about I grab a key and go tapping around? Oh, I'm gonna snoop around. Oh, now which room is this open? Because I wanna know if it opens. Oh, it opens all of these, does it? Well, I'm gonna go in these rooms first. Hmm. Hmm, Cthulhu. Is that you? Oh, well. What have we here? That Cthulhu statue just turned to face me, I think. And I don't want to squish anything in there, so it's pretty much all good, I guess. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh God, it's a dummy. Oh, <laughs> the dummies. You know what? I think I'm going to go into this room first because, you know, it's just... What? Oh, no. <sighs> He's dead. Well, then who Mr. is Gary, that? That doppelganger out there pretending to be me is planning your demise as well. Doppelganger? I thought there was something a bit odd about him. Gary, avenge my death. My sword is in the security office. It will probably lead you there. When his back is turned, slay it with the sword. Consider it done, my old friend. And Garrett, be careful. Whoa, well. <gasps> Things have turned for the turn. Your pal Barney was killed by a Doppelganger! As soon as you can grab the sword, avenge him by killing the imposter. Well, 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 well. Does this seem a bit fishy to you guys? Here he comes. Well, I guess we gotta do it. All clear. Now, let's get you some healing potions. I think I have some in the security room. All right. I better grab the sword and make my move quickly when I get the chance. Kill him. Well, what about here? What's over here? Nothing. Okay. I just like to snoop around where I don't belong. Hmm. Well. Oh, yes. Here we are. I thought we had some in here somewhere. Help yourself. All right. I'm gonna kill you, and all the cake is gone. You don't even care, do you? Oh, no picks, no picks. Well, I guess I gotta trust him. Oh, no. I've been faked Garrett, out. Garrett, you foolish man. You killed your friend Barney, and for what? Because an apparition told you to do so? Sure, make me feel worse than I already do. Join us, Garrett. You're more like us than you know. Somehow, I doubt that. Well, it looks like she's... all blown out white because of that filter I've got on. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. It seems, even though I ruthlessly killed my friend here for no reason, I get to take his key ring, feeling absolutely no remorse whatsoever. Oh, I... 
Oh. Huh? No? No? That, hmm, well, there's got to be a key for that somewhere. I mean, come on now. It's it's got it's got to be around. Yes, well, you see, I am a thief and no stranger to murder am I. Well, now, it looks like the uh, mm -hmm. I guess maybe one of these keys goes here. Ah. Well, what have we here? Some kind of gallery. And there is some kind of hot Amazon chick there with, like, the face of some actress or whatever. I, I don't know what I'm saying. But, uh... Or it's a guy. <laughs> I just, I'm just that way. Uh... <laughs> Stay out of that way. I'd be ready to shoot. Oh, my! <laughs> oh, my! Set. Aim. Fly, goodsy! <laughs> that is a good scene. Okay. It is a chick. Whatever. I, I don't know what my problem is. That's... That is funny. And gruesome. And weird. Just like this... This this whole mission is funny and gruesome and weird and stuff. It a neat effect there. Oh, I love the transparent floors. I'm guessing maybe they had to build a whole other room underneath. That's what you had to do back in the old school days sometimes. And it was tilted and there's a three ghosts in it. Oh! Foreshadowing? Perhaps. Oh, well, now... Whoa! Oh god, the ghosts are... Oh. They're, they're throwing the... They're throwing the dishes! <laughs> Crap! Fortunately, I've got healings. That reminds me of that freaking Back to the Future game, like the, the, the ABGN, where he's like, oh, you gotta, you gotta catch the stuff being thrown at you or something, or throw them at the other guy. Oh. Oh, no, no, I know I remember, I know I remember there's something here, but maybe it's... Oh, God, it's... There, there's... There! There are my picks! Harvey, found these things on the floor tonight when cleaning up... Closing up the bar. Looks like toothpicks or something. I almost threw them away, but figured maybe you knew who they are. What they are. If you don't, just throw them out tomorrow when you open. Sal. Well, Salvador Dali over there. I seem to have some luck picks and the first... Whoa, hey, what are you doing? Don't throw the dishes at me again. God, you jerk. First thing I'm gonna do is go and pick this safe because there might be some loot that I totally care about rather than just simply surviving. And I have to question, since I'm out of the warehouse... God damn it, it can't open it with that either. That's, that's just silly. Making me go all the way over here. Well, she seems to not be firing. That is a badass pose, though, but I mean, seriously. Okay, we're not here, but like, I thought these things were supposed to stop permanently once you, like, get in there, but I guess not. It seems that other door maybe can't be picked or something because you'd get stuff chucked in your face. How much face could a uh, Freddy Krueger chuck if he chucked it in the trash? I don't know. Jeez, stop asking me weird questions. It doesn't make any sense. Oh. However, let me just see. Yep, nothing. All right, don't you throw your shit at me. These are these are not actually loot. They just look like it. Maybe they're wood. I don't know. Seems like there's some light coming from absolutely nowhere. Books, eh? Well, I should stop in for a little light reading. Was there some? No, maybe not. No, no. What? It's a little dingly ball. Okay. Hey, it's like a little key. Oh, there's the safe key, so I guess it is important. It's not just loot. Maybe. Possibly. Whoa, there's like grass by the window. It's all overgrown and taken... Oh, it's just in a plant pot. But it's still a bit scraggly, I gotta say. Oh. Whoa. Nice! I forgot about that. Oh my god, this effect is awesome. Look. The little, the little splash damage models are freaking books. <laughs> Ghostbusters! Anyway... Wow. Somebody screamed and maybe there's a corpse or something to be seen, but I don't really care. I mean, it'd be fun if I could get up there, but I guess there's nothing. It seems to be just for decoration, so I'm guessing that maybe something crazy happens if I bust open this safe here. Let's try it. Huh. A sealed box, eh? Well, I think I know what to do with this. Hell yes, alerting spiders like it was no thing. And the statue's facing that way again. I mean, still, not again, still. Crush! Ha! 
Ah, uh, yes. And raise. And there's some kind of key. Sewer hatch. Always the sewers. And the stench isn't something I look forward to. Attention all friends! Find in this kit a key to access the sewer hatch in the east storeroom. Use it thou all due precaution. I don't think I've ever seen useth spelled out. Interesting. As the ladder hath broken and friend Alvius hath yet to procure a replacement. Meanwhile friend Gregor hath a slow fall potion in the security office if thou hast a need to descend. Hail Karas! <laughs> Hail! Friend Dorius. Not much fine in mine head. No. In, in Stalingrad. No. Oh boy. Nazis are hilarious. Oh, 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 the dummies, the dummies. Oh, they're standing there, and I don't like it. There's some kind of evil circle of mushrooms, and uh, I was going to say something, but I don't remember what. Well, huh, that's... Whoa! I can't believe that just having him pop up and look at me is so scary, but like... <gasps> No matter where I go. Ha 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 ha! I don't know about this man. Next time. So wait, you're telling me the white lady and the eh. evil mechanist spirits tricked you into killing Barney? I'm afraid so. I felt badly, but at least I had the sewer key and could keep looking for a way out of that place. With all the strange goings on, I just wanted to get out of there. Little did I know the ordeal was just beginning. Go on. I jumped down the hole and. <laughs> okay. And you feel badly? Is that your only reaction to killing in cold blood someone who was your friend? Oh, Garrett, you disappoint me, Mr. of Shalebridge. You disappoint me.